Hello, and welcome back to another play on the Road to the War with the House of Julii. Where last time we left off, we had taken Mediolanum, and we now have the option to either go chase off these couple of Gallic units or to uh, head into Patavium. Um, and I think I think we're going to go just straight up for Patavium. But before or Patavium, I'm not sure. Before we do that, we have to move all of our agents and such. Let's see if we can find any. Oh, there's a spy. Oh, and there's a diplomat too. Perfect. All right. How about some trade for map and map? Uh, yeah, no, that's that's not going to happen. All right. Why don't we just do just trade just to get that done? Because that's the most important thing. All right. What about map for map? And I'll pay you a hundred denarii. Sounds good to me. You want 400? Nah, not gonna happen, my friend. Well, um, well I'm sure we'll speak to the Germans again soon, and then we'll just offer it again when we have a little bit more money to play around with. You're gonna keep going to Spain. Um, you are gonna keep going towards the Macedonians, which means we have to go a little further this way. At once. All right. Out of moves. Um. And that is that when it comes to agents. I didn't recruit any more agents or anything to die. Got buildings and all set up. I do. Need to, I wouldn't even think about it. this unit. I don't know if it's really worth having it in our Aretium. I mean, it's definitely planning on going up to the front lines. It's just a matter of what the fastest route is. Do we go through these units? They are stati though, so I don't really want to fight them. Um, I mean, I probably should at some point, but not with like three units because I just lose units and it'd be like a, it would be a waste. Um, but I certainly, I do want to get this guy to the front line, but he can't move right now, so that's irrelevant. This unit wants to sit here for a while longer in case these guys do anything stupid. What I think I will do, this weak unit, I'm going to put it in here, many Alanum, and I'll do that. And we're going to go ahead and besiege Batavia, our spy field, unfortunately. Siege that, and I'm going to throw this general. Uh, general in here again as well. Which means this unit, or this town, loses a little bit of money from less managing, but that's okay. Because I, I've got a feeling these guys might come and attack me in the rear, and I do, I wouldn't mind having an extra general just to make easier flanking and such happen. Um, okay, so I think this unit, you know what, I'll, I will run it to uh, Arminium, and then from there you can run this way. Well, if these guys run in the way, it wouldn't take too long. Um, and of course this unit is planning on going back to the front line, but we will have to wait until we can do that. And this unit as well. Don't really want any of these actual fucking Astati sitting in towns doing nothing. Be a waste. Okay, so that is that. Let's end this turn. Oh, maybe. Uh, that's okay. Oh, what happened? We got attacked. Obviously, but okay, yes, yeah, so they did come after us. Okay. Navy, yeah, I think I had it set up to go all the way back there, so that's okay. I forgot to do that. Sorry, we cannot flee from battle. If it loses, all units will be destroyed. Okay, so we shouldn't have to finish them off. That's good. We have uh, one unit of Warband and one unit of Barbarian Cav. And in here... Oh, shit, I can't check now. I think it was a whole bunch of Warbands and one Barbarian Cav as well, actually. So, it should be a very straightforward army, at least. Alright. This is a fine day to be a Roman going into battle. Every day is a fine day for a battle when your heart is set on doing your duty. Today we fight against monsters. The Gauls, they are dangerous, mad, and hairy beyond reason. In victory, they are always heartless. They stand alone. No friend has come to this place to die for them. Does this not say something about their honor? They're standing among nations? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, doesn't it? Right, guys? Alright, so our the reinforcements of theirs are going to come from behind us, so we should have enough time to straight up kill these first two units. Because they are the ones attacking us. So I'll go ahead and play this one aggressively, to a certain extent. Uh, I should keep guys up. Group dismissed. Group dismissed. Uh, Archers can still sit up front, I suppose. I can start firing at them before I get there. Uh, you guys, I'll turn the other way just in case we get attacked from behind. And you guys too. Both of you can go off skirmish. And 
and you guys can go on fire oil. Alright. If I do this, I'm just wondering. The fairy man will be busy today. The enemy have brought more men to the fight. That's kind of what I wanted, but not really. Okay, let's run everyone into position. Don't really need five units for this, but it's okay. You guys flip the other way. So are you. You guys can run up here. Alright. In fact, I should move my infantry up front right away, shouldn't I? I might even want to just charge them in. I suppose. I really should have one on the other side, actually. Although I don't want them to get caught out by uh, enemy units. You guys actually are going to turn around. So I'm just going to do this. I'm going to charge all three of you. Get you guys a little up closer up as well. One volley and then perhaps a charge. Hopefully that unit buggers off a little bit. Did we even throw? I don't think we did. That was a waste. They've already broken. That was quick. I just gotta break this unit real quick. All oh, right, I should have run this guy in there. There we go. All right. The cool. army is in flight. Pursue them and All drive the them from the battlefield. Turn back. Okay, so there they are. There goes our general. Perfect. Be praised. The enemy general is killed. Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts. This unit will actually, or these guys will have to die fully in order for them to go away. So I would like to kill them off entirely. But I don't know if we'll be able to actually catch this unit constantly. Unless it's going to come back, but I'm not sure if it will. Especially if I keep chasing it off, it probably won't do, will it? Looks like we're, we're, we're getting it, though. If we can kill 85% of it, we should be okay. Right. Archers, you can go up front again. You guys can go over here. We can make this line a little bit longer as well. The cab is on the left side, okay. Which means I'm going to put you guys over here just in case. I don't really want to use you, but... You're gonna come back. Enemy general column. It's um. I have you over here actually. I have you. Seventeen. Hundred and eight. Yeah, we definitely killed eighty-five percent of them, so they should be dead. Okay, this line is not long enough. Need a longer line. Okay, crazy long, like stupidly long. Uh, you guys can actually go over here as well then. And now uh, you're gonna put you off fire at will. Units! I think the most dangerous unit here is probably the Cav, just because we know how much they can do on the charge. The other units, I mean, they're scary too, but they probably won't last very long, I'd imagine. Lost a couple dudes already in some of the units, but that's okay. far that. It's like I can pull the bow back a little further. That's how it works, right? Alright. Look at that. Killed four guys already. I think the archers are better in, uh, like, like, when we're the offensive army. Okay. Don't really want to charge them. We're on fire will anyway, so... I should probably... Do something about this unit though, because they're scary as hell. I'll give him a counter charge. If this is what you want, I took a nice volley as well. They're also the general, there the you go, they brought it. They're, they brought Press it, oh my god, they brought it quick, they brought it too. What the fuck? They've all routed us, what the fuck? I can't say I imagine that. If we can route all the other units as well very quickly, then that would mean that we just straight up win. Is not broken yet. That one might break just from getting charged in the back. There you go. That one's right. There you go. Okay. The enemies show their true virtue. That was pretty easy. They are not soldiers. Only frightened rabbits running from our men. All right, was uh, a lot easier than I expected. Uh, didn't lose any of my important units, so that's all good. Let's kill off as many as we can. Oh, actually, we um. 
get it anyway, don't we? Because it said that they can't retreat. Ah, fuck it. We'll just keep killing. I think we get the experience of these uh, and something. Let the generals do all their murderous work. That was a great battle. I'm surprised how quickly they routed. it. I mean, this is on a very hard, very hard. I didn't think that they would just route from getting, like, literally touching my units. That was kind of some, uh, surprising. But, hey, I'll take it. Can you actually do your job, though, and kill this unit? I feel like you haven't even touched it yet. What is that? Just go... Oh, I do remember that about this game. It's impossible to kill fucking units off. Either way, we've killed 83%, so... If you kill this entire unit off as well, then it'll certainly be dead, even if it wasn't from that mechanic, which, again, it should be, so... But I'll take all the experience we can get, especially this early on in the game. 91%. Again, I think the, uh, the number 85 or 85% works anyway, but regardless. 96, alright. Let's let the rest of them get away, and then we'll see. All oh, Rome will be amazed at such a victory. The day Dang is ours. ours. Always love that one. All right, gained back a couple of Astati as well, so I didn't lose any huge numbers. Probably filled them all up with that unit of 43, although I'm probably keeping them in that town for peacekeeping. Peacekeeping. Victory! All right, there we go. Victory! We did take it. Sweet. This Why not? Is Roman. Means we got the income this turn as well, right away, which is pretty good. There's the Iceni guy, so that's good. Immediately talk to him. Oh, this place is under siege, by the way. Two turns remaining. Okay. I guess we we'll might even see who it is. I'm assuming Gaul, but. Nope, not yet. I'm, oh, I'm sure we'll still see it soon enough. Rebels. A little unfortunate, because they stopped me from getting there in one go. Unless I want to attack this navy. Sure. Wow, that's surprisingly. Ships surprisingly even. Army cannot flee from the battle if it loses all units will be wiped and destroyed. Destroyed even. Okay. Clear. What? Are you kidding me right now? Rope your lives. They managed to get further than I could have done myself, so that's something. Well, I guess you're not getting a lift anytime soon, after all. Sorry. I don't know what the hell that was, but we somehow lost that fight. Uh, Spain and Carter were Armenia and the Seleucid Empire are also at war. We have finished the land clearance in Suggesta. We should probably build something else. Ooh, we made a lot of money this turn, actually. That's pretty good. Look at the income. Oh, man, but is rich as hell. What the fuck? Pretty good. Uh, we want whatever gives tongue or, uh, yeah, growth, which the roads don't and the trader does. It's only one turn, though, for the roads, but they literally don't give anything right now. So, yeah, let's do that. We're still building a building here as well as there. Batavium, we should get the Shrine to Syria. There's sewers there, public health, yeah, I remember that. And we're getting the Shrine here too. Okay. And we did make some money, quite a bit in fact. Good stuff. Batavium, I will lower the taxes though, which will cost me a little bit of money, but that's okay. We have a blacksmith available here for light and heavy weapons, plus one. Not too shabby, actually. Can I see uh, this? The... is it Smiths? Blacksmith, yeah. And then plus one for armor and missile weapons as well, and then plus two for all of that. Okay. So we don't have like a plus... we don't have like gold, do we? I think like with other factions you can get it from a temple as well, but we don't have that. Our temples give other bonuses to other things. Maybe there's some other building I'm not thinking of. Maybe the militia barracks give something, although I don't think so. Okay. We can actually recruit, uh, we can recruit a spy here. It costs a hundred? Yeah. Um, sure, I could do it another spy, why not? Nah, that's, that's actually for now not do that. Because we don't really need one, and it actually is, a hundred turn is a fairly significant amount. I've already got one diplomat too many, really. Especially now that I can't send this one over. I could build a ship, of course, a new one. But I don't really want to. It's the problem with that. What's the population here? 2,500. 7.5% population growth though, holy crap. This is no medieval 2 divide and conquer third age stuff where everything takes fucking ages. Alright, so what's next? I could go over towards here, but I don't know if I want to. There's a bunch of rebel towns around the place. We got this one right here, we got this one right here, and I think we've got a couple further down this way as well. 
Maybe over here somewhere. Oh yeah, you can just about see the border right there, Rebel. But the problem is, that leaves us completely open here. Like, we can't really defend those towns if we go to war with anyone over here. Noble master, so I don't know if I like that too much. Delay. Without delay. Good. Don't like it when people delay. Sir, I shall speak with them Well, I'm like the first to delay shit, so... Uh, Alright, thank you, Iceni, or Britannia, actually, in this game. So now we got map info on their side. Um... See, the only one I really just want more map info from is Germania, and then we're off to the east, I suppose. So let's just keep going this way. Here we go. How about that map info that we talked about, eh? There you go. This guy likes it. He's not as good as Diplomat. Okay, so that's everything, I think. Your honor. Around here. So we'll uh, head up this way and talk to whoever. That's not possible, sir. That's not possible, sir. You've already been moved. Um, okay. Okay. Orders. So this unit's Sir. gonna go over to work. Well, first of all, let's do some mixing and matching. Orders. So let's put all your shit into these other units here. And this agent Adjust also is gonna start heading this way because that's probably what we'll attack first. Then may as well. Sir. If we are gonna go this way out, yeah, I, I think I will. Two towns right here that we get to take for a little bit of extra income and such. And such and such. And also stop the broody eye from expanding that way, so I'll have to go after Greece, which means that we would be somewhat protected for that reason alone. This is another uh, rebel town as well, Pannonia here. Illyria, that's this one, and then this Pannonia. So maybe I leave one or something. No, I probably don't want to do that, because then someone else will just take it, and then they'll board them after all anyway. I think we don't need the entire force, everything, to go after this, so we'll take all these units and see if this place is still happy, which I imagine it would be. That is the path we take, yep, just about. So we'll go and take that with this force. And then what we'll do is we'll send... Uh, this guy I want to lead a ne the next force, basically. If you move out, this place happy. What about you? Yep, alright, so you guys, well, you're gonna go home. To wherever you can get retrained, which would be here, but you have to go through there, so. You're gonna run over here. And so are you. And then this general will be leading them, so we'll send him that way too. And then we have this guy still I uh, forgot about, so we'll send him over here as well. No and we'll probably start gathering our next force towards Medialanum, just because obviously we could get attacked over here at some point. I may even want to put a fort here to stop this entire passage, because then of course they can come from over here, but it's, you know, that's Germania land. Actually, no, it's not. It's all gold, but still. We stopped them from over here. So we'll make that General. guy do that. Forward. Out of move, sir. Move out. Okay, it's a whole bunch of random units all over the place. Move out. Out of move, sir. Um, move out. Sir. Can actually build a watch. Oh, right, watchtowers are a thing. I probably will need some. Ah, oh, I just about. Actually, General. you could do that. March. Build tower. I forgot that's a thing in this game, too. Combining troops. Uh, you, actually, General. this guy has more movement than him. I guess because he's got the drill master, yeah. I should have moved him up here, maybe put one there as well. I can do that later, though. We've got basically all vision around here, regardless. We just need to place some around these areas here. Don't know if I ever did that on my first playthrough. 100% chance, alright. Okay, so diplomats have been moved, everything has been moved, I think. So we can go ahead and end this turn. We are building everywhere in every single location. Next turn we may not have the money to do so because we're finishing a lot of buildings in the same turn. In fact, I think we're finishing literally everything built except for this trader here. Well, we'll find out. Hopefully the rebels don't attack my fleet again because that'll probably just kill them off. Never mind. Can't even withdraw. Heroic victory! Oh, oh and then they've gone that way. So. Actually, I should be able to get back in now. So I can at least retrain them. Okay. War declared. Also, is this taken yet? Rebel Town at war. Egypt and Swiss Empire at war. Awaiting your command. Yeah, Gaul took it. Okay. Five units in there, but it's a very small flag, so these are probably very wounded. Going now. Without delay. Good to know that. Definitely a good call to start General. making this force here, I think. Sir. Okay, so you're gonna get 
go up there, and in fact, this unit's gonna come with you then. So we'll uh, throw you back into Mediolanum. You're gonna go in there. You're gonna go in there. You're gonna go back here. And then you're gonna go there. But I can't do that right now, of course. At your service. Right, you're gonna go in there. Three units of Valyrian mercenaries, which are missile attack units, so... Cav will be quite good, although these guys may have a bonus... Nope, no bonus versus uh, cavalry, so that's good. Alright, Spy, show me... Oh, he did it! Nice one. Alright, so we'll go ahead and do that in a minute. Um, Alright, so you're just gonna go over here and build a tower. Uh, sorry, a fort, even. Probably should have recruited more units, actually, but then again, we do need the money. Alright, I want to retrain these. It's pretty expensive. Let's hold off on that, actually, because I think we're gonna put priority in building buildings for the moment. Um... Let's see, so every single town. This one, we've got clear up uh, choices. We just go for the Temple of Ceres. This place, roads, what does that do? Nothing. Uh, trader. Not really too bothered with unit stuff, really. That gives a very small amount of money, but it does give that as well. Communal forums probably get more. Uh, a little bit, not too much. Um, maybe 600 denarii, though. We'll take that. That's also 600 denarii, though, to be fair. Batavium, we've already got that one, so that's fine. Arminium, we are going to take a trader, probably. It's also only a small bonus, too. The farms are a little bit larger, not too much. But again, it gives the extra bonus of stuff. And then lastly, we're going to go for the communal farm here, I think, as well. That's a little bit... Also, devastation, somehow. Or the trader... I think trade actually increases in other towns as well, though, which is my number might be smaller. Let's go for trader. No. Yes, we'll go for trader. In fact, you know what? Let's do that here, too. Mm, yeah. Yeah, let's do it for now. And then I want to recruit units, and I can actually still retrain these two. So I'll go ahead and do that. Okay. Agents. It's just time for you to move further. Maybe we'll meet someone on the way as well. Without delay. Well, not you. Are you going to reach Your Macedonia honor. today? Honor. Oh, diplomat, good enough. Alright, thank you. And that gives us all the info there. Oh yeah, we were going to reach the town, I thought so. And there's a Greek town, so we'll go for them. Uh, also, we, we got all this shit here, of course. Build roads and temples and stuff. Yeah, we do that. Ah, we got a sun coming of age. Nice one. Who are you? You are... One command, understanding of strategy, he's a poor trader, and he's bored by races, plus one to unrest. Alright, this guy, 5% penalty to popularity with the people. Uh, this guy we do not want in a town, that's for sure. We want him to be with an army, so I suppose he can come with this one. Uh, yeah, let's not put him in the town, that's a poor idea. And we made money, good stuff. Okay. Other agents. We still have the guy in Spain, I believe. Right. No, he's already moved. Well, he's not in Spain yet, but he's going there. Um, we've moved that guy, moved this guy. That one can't be moved. So I think all that rests to do is. Uh, I need a town watch for that unit, or a peasant. Probably a peasant. In fact, I really should probably get rid of these town watch at some point and recruit peasants instead. Although I don't think peasants are much cheaper. They're the same upkeep, actually. They are more men too, so there's actually no real reason to go for them. These guys are cheaper to buy, or more expensive to buy, but only the 50 bucks, I don't really know. May as well have a town watch, they could actually fight a little bit. Um, anyway, so I think that's, that's fine. And also, yeah, peasants will just take away a lot more population, which is a big thing. I want to... I feel like I'm forgetting something, but maybe not. Let's do it. You recruit any mercenaries, you can. Illyrian's mercenaries would be interesting, actually, but I don't have the money for it right now. I could do it if I cancel that unit here, or retraining something. Um, they're not particularly good, but I could just use them as a, a meat, meat shield. Yeah, I'm tempted by that, actually. I'm tempted enough that I will do it. I'll uh, stop the training of the Astati. No, I'll stop the retraining of one of these units. I'll retrain the weakest one. Alright, let's do that. I could even recruit two now. Yeah, why not? What? 
Oh, I didn't have the money after all. They just let me put them in there for whatever reason. Attack! Okay. Anyway. They have three units of Illyrian Illyr mercenaries, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna freebie one my dudes against theirs. Nah, I won't do that. I probably will get rid of them after this battle, though, or maybe leave them here uh, to peacekeep. We'll see how expensive they are upkeep-wise. But um, yeah, I don't really care for their lives too much. Today we make our own fates. The omens may say that we face disaster, but I choose to think differently. Can any true man do otherwise? Rebellious slaves may think of victory, but we should make them think kindly of their master's whips. They are dead men walking. They have been lulled into a false sense of security by a few feet of defensive wall, as if that will protect them. Last time I fought those men, we were unlucky. It is now time to take revenge for that defeat and teach them to fear us anew. What? I have won many great victories for Rome. Be strong in that truth, and let this be one more. March on, and know that our victory is assured as long as we live and die like true Romans. Did we lose a battle against rebels? What? No one told me about this. I keep forgetting to rearrange this, by the way. I only have four Astati left now. Alright. Alright. Uh, in fact, my archers should be fairly useful here. Because we can just outrange them. These guys have a higher melee a ranged attack than these Vilates of ours do, by the way. Illyrian mercenaries. And I will likely use these in, melee, in battle too. And you guys, of course, just cover the back. Alright. Actually, just use the entire force. Yeah, good enough. Let me do that. Right. So we're just gonna shoot them. We uh, can just charge them with our cap, probably, and just win, but I don't really necessarily want to try anything. I don't want to, um. I don't want to have my generals die from just, like, stupid stuff like that. Also, why is the gate so busted? Like, we had a spy open it, we didn't break it open. The spy just, like, sneakily opened it. 121, that's... man, that's destroying these guys, holy crap. They have shields too. I guess they're just not as good as I thought, defensively anyway. Oh, nope, don't do that, just go fire well. Keep running around. They'll come towards me now, here you go. Keep running in circles. This, I'm sure this will work out eventually for you. You're gonna run out of ammo at some point, but then we'll just use the next unit in the Illyrian mercenaries. They won't win, obviously, in 2v1, but they'll do some damage. Hopefully these guys get a little bit closer. Probably wasting a ton of ammo here. Yeah, we used that. Uh... No, that's dead. We used a significant amount on just one unit. Uh, luckily, we can do a good old strategy here. Of uh, just routing them one by one. In fact, I'm gonna get you inside too, but I'm gonna... Great gods! Our soldiers have done well this day! The Go all the way around. Alright. Whoa, what, what are all these other units? Oh, this is my cap, okay. For a second I thought well, my infantry just somehow went inside for whatever reason. Gonna stay right here, yeah. These guys are gonna move. Oh, fuck, fuck. Oh, shit. I didn't realize. Oh, that's rough. That's rough. I'm gonna lose a whole bunch of men here. Unless they. Oh, god, I need to go. Normal speed. There we go. Get in there. You guys stop. Stop. Stop running. No, no, no. Please run away. Oh, I don't wanna lose all my archers here. Please don't make me lose all my archers. I don't wanna have my general in melee either. I lost like 10. Archers, fuck. The there enemy general is slain, and now his Doesn't men fear down. us. It is time to press the attack. Wavering. Oh, there we go. Never mind. Just uh, whatever then. Ah, oh, if only I'd noticed. Wait, there's still an archer in there. Don't do that. Don't go far away. Well, that was annoying. I really shouldn't have lost that unit. I just didn't realize that was the only problem I had there. 
Right, well you can go back to where I told you to go. Same strategy, especially if that unit starts coming towards me. Ah, oh, I didn't lose that. I need to lose those archers though, it's just stupid. If you guys can get there quick, we can actually just do a full on charge to the back. And then just charge them again. So if you guys run out. Wait a little bit longer and I'll move them over here. And then I'll just charge them in the back and charge my main guy in the front. Captain Scorillo. Capture the gateway. Fantastic. Unleash hell, boys. Wouldn't have it any other way. Will they route on impact? Unfortunately, we are going to get here first. Uh, about the same time. There we go. The gods be, oh, gods be praised. Be amazed at such a victory. The day right. is ours. We uh, we got back three of the archers at least. We lost eleven, so we lost eight in total. Could have been better. Could have been worse. It's okay. That was an easy victory! take at least. Settlement captured. Just can't. I can't recruit archers for quite a while. And that's just that why I don't want to lose them. Alright, so Jessica, we're gonna get a shrine to Ceres. Go lower taxes. We have mines available here too, so we're gonna get income from here. Alright, that is where I'm going to end up this episode. So, for now, thank you all very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. We got a military tribune. Plus one to come out on defending. Improves chance of getting elected to senatorial officers. Nice. But popularity with the Senate as well. Nice. But yeah, that's gonna be that. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Next time, we might continue with this army and take the other town down here somewhere. And perhaps we'll even go around taking all these towns here too, but I'm not sure. We'll see. Either way, have a good day and goodbye.